Hey, hey everybody. everybody, welcome, welcome to, to the Hutch Food Adventures. Adventures. Today we've got a treat for you. And us. Mostly us. You yep. know the drill. <laughs> We're doing a beer tasting. Beer, 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 beer. Damn. Not to get drunk. Well, not for both of us to get drunk. We still have responsibilities, you know, like regrets. <laughs> said, I feel like he ruined that word more than you did. He's like, responsibilities. He did, but you know, I'm, hey, I'm sorry. We have a very small monster named Mowgli outside. So we've been getting a request to do San, Man, San, Miguel, <laughs> San Miguel Wild Horse bring beer it, for a long time. So guess what we got? I've been waiting to do this beer, but every we got so many requests because we do a lot of beer food, and you've been pregnant for so long. I don't even know how many months. I was actually pregnant for a short week. <laughs> Four Already weeks. drunk? Four weeks shorter than a normal full term, like actual four week pregnancy. Yeah. So. And I've been walking around. I wasn't pregnant for so long. Dang, these birds are wild. It's like they hammering on the dang wall. Yeah, if we don't post on a Wednesday, it's because these crows came through our fireplace. Yeah, we have crows up in our uh, in our fireplace, and they're not like I mean, they're like hammering. Like okay, look, they're at the very top. Like there's this mesh thing, so they can't get in and whatever. But like they sit up there, and, and they like hammer. It's crazy. It's terrifying. So I've been walking past this beer at the store for a long time and we finally can drink it. It is the Red Horse Beer San Miguel. This bad boy is strong. Mm -mm, mm -mm. It says, give a kick. Me, oh, I was gonna say that. You can read the I description. Was gonna say, Red Horse Beer. Get a kick. Kick, 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 kick. 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 Babe, we gotta light that fireplace. I These know. birds is tripping. You guys, I'm scared. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Don't be scared of no crows. These crows are as big as Kobe. You know <laughs> what they say, a bunch of crows in one place is a murder. Babe, come on. Don't be... Okay, okay. Let's, uh, let's Wait, we it. didn't read it. You're supposed oh to read God. the thingy. Don't watch her. Watch this. Okay, get the opener in the meantime. Okay, read that Saddle. while I pour it. Saddle up and get ready to ride Red Horse into a robust, full-flavored adventure. Cooked longer with a special fermentation process, this deeply hued, full-body lager, lager, lager? Lager. Lager boasts of a distinctive Swedish taste, balanced by a smooth bitterness and a well-rounded mouthfeel. Delightfully light to drink, even with 8% ABV, Red Horse hits you with a unique flavor to power through. That's not how I Look, let me tell y'all something. That was so stressful because, you know, you don't want to be up on camera stuttering and reading things wrong, even though I messed up lager. I don't drink beer. I'm the beer drinker around here. So that was really stressful I feel me. like it needs to be more aggressive no, for doesn't. something I so strong. No, I think that was fine. And I think that you guys, come on. And I Saddle up and get ready to ride. Red Horse Ew. into a robust, Full flavored adventure. This is cringy. Cooking longer with a special fermentation process. Why are you reading it like this? this? Deeply hued, full bodied lager boasts of a distinctive Swedish taste, balanced by a smooth bitterness and a well rounded mouthfeel. Delightfully light to drink, even with 8% ABV. Red Horse hits you with its unique flavor and powerful strength. Cheers to Red Horse. That's not guys, the sound a horse makes. No, it's not at all. It's the crows. Mine was, mine was much better. <laughs> Whose was better? Put it in the comments. Who who would be the Red Horse voice actor in their commercials? You let us know. Me. Let's try this out. First, we smell. Oh, we have two beers, by the way. This we didn't even tell like them a... there's a second beer. No, we didn't. There's another beer coming. We'll get to it. Cheers. Smells like a lager. Mm -hmm. Wow, it is sweet. It's like malty. They call it malty. You guys, this is really interesting. I don't drink beer, as you heard me say, but like as soon as it hits your tongue, you get a sweet taste, but then you get like the typical like beer carbonation feeling. <laughs> wow. The best way for me to describe it, 
would be like a dull sweetness. Like you mm -hmm. almost look forward to more. Yeah. But it's... then you're like, hmm, mm -hmm. it's beer. Yeah, it's like just, it's refreshing. Um, it really tastes to me like a strong lager. Like it's heavier. Um, it does have a good maltiness and um, no bitterness whatsoever, pretty much. This is like a very easy drinking, dangerous beer, I would say. Um, I can see why this goes well with a lot of some of the fried beer snacks that we have. Oh, for sure. I could definitely see that. Like, it started to make sense. I'm like, this is what people work in this. Mm -hmm. I um, am not mad at it. The Kubi. I'm not mad at it, but would I want to like buy a pack and drink them? Yeah. Probably not, but I probably would. I might change my mind if I had some um, like snacks with it. Yeah. Yeah, this is that one you need snacks with it or you're going to get drunk. All right. Mm. Next up. Next up. Let's work these out real quick. Hi. Next beer on the list. I love you. Next beer. Dragon's milk. Uh, excuse me. Okay. Dragon's Wait, milk. Don't say that as you're burping. Dragon's milk white. Dragon's milk white. Bourbon barrel aged white stout. So it's dark. I well it says white. No. I've never heard of a white stout before, so this is super interesting to me. Okay. All stouts are like super dark. So I'm curious why they're saying white. Sorry. So that it looks okay. So it is like, um, it's not white, it's gold, which for a stout is about as white as it could get, considering they're all like coffee, like dark coffee colored. But this is, this should be interesting. And this is gonna have, this is gonna have some bourbon flavor to it. I, this uh, is like a, is it like citrusy? It shouldn't be. It should be more like in the chocolatey realm. Let's taste it. Let's see. Cheers. I don't know if we chose the last one because it's the only broken glasses right now. <laughs> it's the, the alcohol. Wow. Interesting. Mm. Yeah. Whoa. You talking? It's like definitely less like carbonated tasting. Um, it definitely tastes like um, like darker, like um, semi sweet. Very Almost like, like much, not nearly as sweet as the dragon one. Still trying to find, figure out what it tastes like to me. I feel like it tastes like not as sweet as the horse one. And I almost feel like I wouldn't describe it as chocolate, but I would describe it as some sort of like dark flavor. Yeah. But again, I can't put my finger too much on it. I think it's the bourbon. It's like bourbon barrel aged. So maybe there's some bourbon in there. It doesn't taste like a stout. Like stouts usually are semi sweet chocolate, coffee. It's not that. It's more of an ale to me. To me, it tastes like an ale. It's good, but I don't think it is what it promised. Not enough bourbon and not enough stout. So, because of that, I'd say Don Miguel wins as it, uh, it gives what it promised. A strong lager, slightly sweet. For me, I actually might prefer to drink this more than the the red horse. You too? He agrees. <laughs> Kobe's been talking a lot, you guys. Yeah, he's Very like, how dare y'all not have me on camera? You talking to mama? All right, well, All right, there guys. you have it. I prefer the dragon's milk. He prefers I'll take the red horse. The red horse. With a kick. It looks like we both win. Everybody wins, but you guys, unless you go buy your own pack. Boom. <laughs> and make sure you let us know what else we should be trying. Any yeah. other beverages, foods, snacks. And remember to drop a comment and let us know who read it best. Who read it best? Be honest too. You yeah. won't hurt her feelings. Yeah. All right, you guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Share with your friends. And hit the noti bell.
Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. It's been real. Bye. Bye.